the P. Diddy rejuvenation ceremony. I can tell you right now, some of these people would not have been there if they didn't have to be. Mainly Dr. Dre. Dr. Dre don't show up for nothing. He don't go anywhere for anything, for anyone. Dr. Dre had to show up. Just like Kim Kardashian and Beyonce had to be there together. And Kanye and Jay-Z had to be there together. And Kim Kardashian's exes had to be there with Kanye. Everybody who's somebody, I say almost everybody who's somebody, and the hip hop elite and beyond had to show up to the ceremony. Cause for one, this was a blood drinking ceremony, a rejuvenation ceremony. Diddy's birthday was November 4th, which by the way, happens to be a satanic holiday. He turned 50 November 4th. Jay-Z turned 50 December 4th. Beyonce's birthday is September 4th, 444. But P. Diddy's child's mother, the one he was with for so many years, the twins mom, Kim Porter, her birthday is December 15th. This ceremony happened on December 14th, which bled in to December 15th. Because the whole purpose of the ceremony is they all had to gather to drink blood. You see right here, TMZ says what they what they served to eat and stuff they were eating, the McDonald's stuff, some basic stuff, and it said, and the fancy stuff too. That's the blood. They had to drink it after 12. They had to be there before 12, drink it after 12. The ceremony bled in to Kim Porter's birthday. She died November 14th of last year, I believe it was. November 15th or 14th of last year. So whose blood do you think they was drinking? Why did Diddy wait 40 days after his birthday, 10 days after Jay-Z's birthday, to have this party? Almost everybody who somebody had to go had to attend this party to, to be part of the ceremony. P. Diddy rejuvenation ceremony gives you 314. 314 is the number of pi. Pi is infinite. They're drinking this blood to remain infinite, to reach the halfway point of their lives. Diddy and Jay-Z both are 50, just turned 50 years old. Many people would believe that Biggie Smalls was really killed for Jay-Z to prevail. His sacrifice was really something to do with Jay-Z to take his spot. And that is, that's exactly what happened for anybody who's old enough to remember. But this thing was definitely not about P. Diddy's birthday. This was a blood drinking ceremony. Best believe after 12 o'clock, somewhere along the night, they all would drink blood either together or separately. And whose blood do you think they drink?